This is line 50. Slower. All right, so this, um, this could be used over an A minor chord, uh, sort of an Aeolian sound, so basically the key of C, or I could do it over like a D minor. I'm gonna, that's, that's what I'm gonna do here. So I'm sort of taking an A minor over a D minor. When you're playing a minor chord, if you go up a fifth and do a minor, it often sounds really good. Um, so I'm gonna start off here and I'm gonna do um, G, E, C, A, which is a straight A minor seventh chord. Then I'm gonna do a straight E minor seventh chord. Now in any given key, you have three uh, minor chords. So you have the root chord, and then you have two other minor chords. Uh, in this case, if I'm playing like a D Dorian is which I'm, what I'm thinking, like out of the key of C, I've got D minor, E minor, and A minor. So I'm gonna cover that A minor and that E minor, and then I'm gonna go through a series of thirds, uh, A, F, G, E, F, D. Uh, so, down to the E, and then I'm gonna do G, and I'm gonna do basically the exact same, but down an octave, and I'm gonna sweep it with a different uh, rhythm of B, ba, ba, ba. So instead of B, da, 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 this one's gonna be B, ba, ba, ba. B, ba, ba, ba. So G, F, E, and then A, or sorry, C, A, which is the uh, seven and five over this chord. So, let's try it in context. That's line 50.